Welcome back to Let's Play Lunar the Silver Star. Last time, remember, we just got ourselves a dragon shield. And the all purpose dragon fire spell. In which you will see later. So, it's now time for us to go and see the blue dragon. We got new enemies. A monster wasp and an ogre. Witty. Wow, should we be scared? The enemies around here are a lot stronger. But... Still, not as strong. And yes, believe it or not, that is another Eternal Blue enemy. A lot of Lunar's enemies do come back in Eternal Blue. That's what most people don't know. Just most of them have been renamed to protect the innocent. So we gain 123 experience. Gain, uh, and Nash gains a level. Blech. Wonderful. Now, there's something around here you should know. There's a male and a female bath, right? Thing is, we both need soap for both areas. Excuse me. We both need soap for both. A we need soap for both areas. Now I remember in the remake, it was surrounded by an idiot worth of heartache. That's right. I'm talking about there was a forest, an optional forest. It wasn't required, it was just an optional force that you had to pass through in order to get to that one area. Stupid. This place is known as a transmission spring, but it hasn't been used in over 10 years. No one around here knows how to operate this spring anymore, so leave me alone. Well, I wonder where it would take us. And we have even more new enemies. A nightmare and a mage goblin. They're not as powerful as one might think it is. And they cast paralysis. But no matter. He's dead and we get 104 experience. And Kyle gains level. And so does Jessica. We're doing pretty good in levels. Let's heal and move on. Now next area we are going to we are currently in the study zone. So you're probably wondering where we're we going to. We're going to Lighten. This is the village of Lighton. Welcome to the village of Lighton. Yes, for those who don't know. Lighten is a very lively village in which people sing. In the remake, 
oh man, this this pretty much gets jacked up to the point where it just gets funny. So, the crisis here is this. It's something is going on. We're not kids. We're actually adults, even though we're small. Yeah, they sing, so therefore I had to sing every goddamn part. I'm the musician here. I had a dream about a boy. A boy that would become Dragon Master. And that boy's name was Alex. And he had green eyes. <laughs> what is your name, lad? Alex. Oh, so you're Alex. Let me break the curse placed on the river. Now Alex can cross the river. Yes, who I am is not important. What I'm about, that's important. My precious young lady, let me hear you sing. Okay, I'm a good singer. So listen up, so listen up good. No, oh, please, just go. I don't want to die young. Please stop! Look who's talking, Mr. Tone Deaf over there. Yeah, pretty much here we have to. In the remake, you had to fix the, um. the wind pipes. That was right by the village. Because the music sounded one way, but it sounded off key and flat. Whereas. Once you fixed it, it sounded right again. Stern looking brother, why do you not sing? I can sing if I really want to. Here, listen to this. I'm calling on, sir, you know, my looks are as great as my bow. The women all love me, but who can resist? I'm a great lover, yet great with my fist. Oh, what a terrible song. You must be tone deaf. Hey, who are you to judge? At least I saw the rhyme. Even though it sounded like he was doing this. Uh oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, I don't. Uh, I, I should really stop while I'm ahead. Long, long time ago, whenever. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Lunar was under an attack. And I got in Olivia Melanine. Then took our weapons in our pro I'm sorry. <laughs> long, long ago, a boy named Dying came to the Dragon Blue. He found the door to the cave of blue. Neath the waterfall. Yes, neath the waterfall. Yeah, for anybody who is toned down, please turn away from this episode right now. Unless you want to get hurt. Snobia has taken my daughter. Why her? Why now? Oh, gee. I can't sleep a day. She's gone. She's gone. Why did this, this happen to me? And why am I still singing? I don't even do this. My daughter's been taken. Zenobia's the cause. I know she must be crying. So repays my heart. As we got to try to rescue all the girls, including Luna. Well, uh, uh, yeah. No, that didn't sound right. We had to rescue all the girls, including Luna. If you say you're going to rescue all the girls then you shouldn't say include this person. Because this person is also of the same gender. That is a double negative. I simply apologize because I don't really... Oh, good lord. <clears throat> 
We sing without the day's done. We sing without tomorrow's come. You know what? This is the village of light home. Welcome to the village of light home. You know what? You know what? It will cause me to smurf out, okay? I'm sorry. We like the goddess, love beautiful songs. All of our words turn into songs. Yeah, you know what? I, I'm going to leave this place because I swear to God, I'm going to start going into smurf mode if I, if I start breaking out in song. Okay, for those who really want to know, here's a little thing about herbs. Let's pull up our items, and I'll show you. Now, I don't have regular herbs on me, because I use them. Oh, actually, I do. Okay, for regular herbs, they give about 25% of your health back. A jasmine gives about 50%. A calm herb gives about 75%. And of course, the herb of Althea gives full power back. So, yeah. That's worth it, you know. So since we don't need this iron shield, let's proceed. Oh, that is cold, man. I only left for like two seconds and all of a sudden they start jumping me. What the fuck, man? Seriously, what the fuck? You didn't have to go and do that, but oh no, you had to do that. For most of us who are here, oh crap, really? Seriously? Seriously, you got to be kidding me. Freaking little monkey. So everybody gains 159 experience and me gains a level. Well, you're probably wondering about this area, which I'm going to. Do we need to fight you? I guess so. Same before. I guess I can go in here. Will this lead me to the other side? This cave leads to the prairie. However, there's an epidemic there, so they're not letting anyone visit. Okay, so this takes us. This takes us to um, our next area, which will be Powell.
RTC man, RTC, I'm a RTC man. Well, let's see what's down here. Do we have to go down here? Hello. This is. This seems like Tomor. Am I right? Yeah, that's Tomor. So yeah, Tomor, which kind of leads to Pau. I gotta read that. Now that he's the Magic Emperor, Galleon's power must be tremendous. Yes, his power dwarfs mine by a factor of 30. Can you believe that? He's one bad mother! <laughs> I know, I had to do that, but... Galleon, he's a bad... He's one bad mother... Shut your mouth! I'm only talking about Galleon. We can do So, right now, we are currently just exploring the areas in the Estadio Zone, and those two, as you see over there, are Tempest and Fresco. Tempest, of course, is the chieftain of the, pal of the Prairie Tribe. But, right now, I'm not interested in going to see them. For right now, our business is that of the Blue Dragon. I'll probably make some obscure reference. Some obscure reference to this whole thing. And yes, like I said, there are, there are clues as to what I put in. Like the last one, of course... It, Happen to be a movie, a, a movie, um, reference. Alex gains level. Nash gains level. And he learns thunder shots. One. Cool, cool. We like, we like. Okay, so, let's see. Let's head on back here to Lighten. Let's leave Lighten. And let's go upwards. Really, you guys, this is getting old really fast. Yeah, we're gonna spend quite some time in the Stadia Zone. Mainly because... Well, pretty much... We need the... Gil and... Gil. We need the experience and the silver. Not Gil. We need the silver. That's what we're doing it for. So we're doing it for the money and the experience. And Jessica gains level and learns Luck Litany. Cool, we're getting there. Alright, so now that the spell upon the river is broken, we can proceed further. We can proceed into going our into our next area, which happens to be the blue. <laughs> Dragon, the blue dragon cave. I, I am 
in terms of this Frisco. I bang my girlfriend every night. On the hour, every hour. And she screams more, more, harder, faster, stronger, better, harder, faster, stronger. Identify yourself. <laughs> Uh, 124 experience. You know, the stuff I'm on, you don't want to know. Man gains level. And we get our MP recharge. Oh, let's see. No, that doesn't take us nowhere. How about over here? Yes, it takes us to here. Which leads to the Blue Dragon Cave. Currently, we are in Blue Dragon. Howl for me, Blue Dragon! Yes, howl for me, Blue Dragon. Howl for me. Dragonfish. Oh, yes, I haven't shown off Dragon Fire. So, here I'm going to show off Dragon Fire. That's powerful right there. Count gains level. And we get Sage's Clothes, which is stronger than... Which is stronger, I must admit, yes. Sage's Clothes, that will work. I haven't forgotten about the red chest, mind you. And a jasmine. So, since we are here... Oh, went around in a circle. Who knew? So as we are going around in circles, we got holy water. You know what? I don't need to walk around in circles, walk around in circles. We don't need holy water. We're nearly out of room here. I like, I like it when everything is getting straightforward, so. As you can see, Starlight gives you 30 MP back. Whereas, a Silverlight will give you more. Possibly, all your, all your match. Back. So I'm going to use a bit of starlight, just because a I'm running low on I'm running low on space. And look, we have another recurring enemy: the water elementals and a goldfish. The question is. Are they susceptible to attack? And do I have to break my foot off in their ass? I guess I have to break my foot off in their ass. Really? I guess I gotta break my foot off in your ass then. Wonderful. So we gained some experience, and Nash gains level. Now I'm 
going up, I think. No, 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 I'm not going up, I'm going down. Alright. Okay, I think we need to run, we don't really need to stay here any longer. I got a mission. Oh, fine. Damn water elements. Gotta love the AI in, on this one. It's like auto aim. So we get one one sixty nine silver and one hundred thirty seven experience. Okay, moving on. Are we anywhere closer to our flipping destination? I do not want to be around you guys. Holy flute! I'd like to know why. Why do they do nipples? I think I'm going somewhere. No. Thank you. <laughs> yes, that's right. No, thank you. Power barrier. I guess I can equip that. Yeah, power barrier, yeah. I guess we're going the right way. I was about to say, Mia, don't get yourself hit. Don't, don't get yourself hit, girl. Down here we have a silver light. Okay, I think we cleared this room already. to fight every time, you know, they come in. I mean, I do believe we are strong enough to handle. I mean, well, we are certainly fast enough, that's for damn sure. Okay, let me see. No, where am I? Before, okay. Yeah, before I go... Yeah, before I go. Let me just say, this area is going to be quite short, so therefore getting the... Dragon Helm is going to be done in one episode. Unlike the other area, which took me three episodes to get the Red Dragon shield, the blue dragon helm shouldn't take as long as getting a holy shield. Wonderful. Let's see.
Yeah, that'll do. Because we are running low on space, so we have to either sell or drop. Moving on, I do not want to waste time trying to... Oh, wonderful. It's the Brainiac! Not even from Superman, either. Okay, so this is our boss, the Brainiac. I think we're gonna line him up with some flame bomb. Oh, you go attack. Keep the health up. Nash, go with Thundershot. And let's see. Double up on the point. What the hell, man? That attack was stupid. Okay, so basically... We can beat up on this guy. I think it's all good. We can beat up on this guy. Very susceptible to physical hits, so... Therefore... We can well weigh on this jackass. Let's see, we haven't tried anything from Kyle, so let's do the fast cut. Keep the health going. Thank you. Timing was spot on perfect. And since the Brainiac isn't really going to go anywhere... Ouch. How about you have a taste of some dragon fire? Some nice level 2 dragon magic for your ass. Kind sir. Oh yeah, that works. Oh yeah, it's okay for you to hit me, I don't mind. And on top of that, Dragon Ball. Kyle, I think you're kind of low on some health, so um, I think it's best for you. To keep on now. Mind you, there are only two bosses coming up, so therefore, after this one, then there's the Black Dragon, so there's going to be a boss in the Black Dragon area as well, just to let you know. So, I'm going to start wailing away with more Dragon Fire. This guy with a fast cut. Hopefully, 
Cal can stay in this fight. Switch back to normal attacks. Let's see what a little tornado will do. Well, never mind! We just wiped out the Brainiac. And we get 132 silver for our efforts and 397 experience. for all our hard-earned hardships. All that work, all that least of leveling, we got it. Okay, so Jessica just gained a level, and pretty much that's it. Save no. Thank you, no. Moving on. Look, we got nothing to prove. So now that we've done it, it is time for us to claim what is rightfully Alex's. I am the spirit of the blue dragon. My power is fading as the world descends into darkness. Take my helmet and remember this. Evil cannot stand before one who remains true to their heart. Thank you for the free boost. And with that, we get... The Blue Dragon Helmet. So on top of that, we get... Alex is the third piece of dragon gear we collected. Dragon tier. So Alex gains 400 experience, a level up, and learns Bright Blast. Kyle gains 400. He also gains level. So does Jessica. And Nash, who also gains a level. And Mia, who also gains a level. And learns Wartful. Alex, I didn't think you'd make it here by yourself. Really, Zenobia? You, ugh, honestly. I guess you do have a few surprises after you, Dragon Boy. Nash, grab the helmet and bring it here. So, uh, yes, Mr. Zenobia, as you wish. <laughs> Excellent undercover work, Nash. I'm happy that I served you well. Oh, you served us well, all right. These unsuspecting fools actually trust you. Zenobia's mouth. I never would have believed it. Nash is going to get a beating once we once we get to the next town. Do not worry. So we just lost ourselves one dragon helmet. But the thing here is in the original. Um, well, in the original, we do not face a boss battle with Nash. So, we have no time for you, sir. So, what I'm going to do is, 
I'm gonna get myself all the way back out the door. So, I'll see you in a bit. There we go. We're done. I say we're done here. Look, she's been through a lot, alright? Jeez. What do we want? It's a good thing there's a lot of healing mounds around this area. But the good thing is... This area has been wiped clean. So, let's use our... Let's use our wings to go to lighten. I'm not singing this no more. Dragon Master Day was invincible, or so we all thought. But the truth was so, when only one returned from the Black Cave. It was Dai's last adventure, it was his last hurrah. Galia was the only one left. When the battle was done, a smile left his face, never to return. Dine and Galleon went to defeat the Black Dragon together. Both of them fought valiantly long, long ago. Look now, y'all gonna make me have to break out the la 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 Oh my, we had the helmet of the blue dragon stolen. But cheer up, Alex, you have green eyes. Again, the question remains, what does that have to do with anything? <sighs> so... I guess the only thing we had to do is... Warp to... The next town over, which happens to be Tamor. So exactly what's going to happen in Tamor? Well, you're going to have to find that in the next part.